Speaker, I join others today in celebrating this next step, this large step in completion of the Rouge, Rouge National Urban Park. The Minister of Economic Development and Growth and the member for Wellington and Halton Hills listed at length those who have contributed to this effort, this achievement. I would just like to add the name of Lois James uh, to those who are thanked today. For those who haven't met Lois, my experience in the past was Lois would ask me how I was after she asked me what was happening with the park. So you, just so you understand her priorities. Uh, speaker, the persistence and vision of those community activists, environmental activists, environmental groups were critical, key, central uh, to this project moving forward. Not to take away from any government or government agency that helped, but it was the people on the ground and the people concerned about the environment who gave the political push uh, to make this happen. And they deserve an awful lot of credit. I want to take this opportunity to ask that Ontario take strong action to curb sprawl and protect more of the land in and adjacent to the Greenbelt. Southern Ontario is biologically rich, and that's in part why the Rouge Park is such a gem. We should celebrate the park, but we should commit to preserving our biological wealth by curbing sprawl and taking the spirit of making this park happen and spreading it further in Ontario. Thank you, Speaker. Thank you.